faith is really trusting in God. The sign language for faith and trust are very similar. In your brain, you trust God mm. and we can't see it, but we know that we'll be able to get through those trials and those tests and that they can be successful. So I always try to teach that even if you can't see something, it can be real. Can, can, can I see, so you said the signs for faith and trust are very similar. Maybe you could teach all of us, including me. Yeah, so this is faith. Okay. It kind of starts in your head and you come out here. And then trust is, is very similar. It's just like this. Okay. Because, well, I mean, there's such insight in that because that's exactly mm -hmm. true. I mean, faith is trust. Uh, and uh, so, so I love seeing that visualized in these signs. Jamila, were there any stumbling blocks that you had to remove that allowed you to exercise faith and draw closer to Christ? I think of just the negativity that people had about me and my deafness and just having that deaf status. You know, I often would feel, I, I asked God, you know, the frustrating things, the rejection, the dismissal, the negative attitude, people thinking I can't because I'm deaf, you know, people not wanting to interact with me. Why was my question. Why do I have to go all of this? Why, why did you let this happen to me? And I think just in that process of trying to figure that out, I got to a point where I'm willing to accept who I am. You made me who I am. And you made me the way you want me. And recognizing that these are challenges, but I can overcome them. And then become an example really helped me to view myself in a different way and be able to show love to others. It wasn't something I was able to accept and understand immediately. It took me time, line upon line, to understand how Jesus' approach with people who persecuted him is a pattern that I can apply to myself as a deaf person. But over time, seeing that love and again, having that faith, you know, that even though we have those stumbling blocks, we can climb that mountain, we can get up, we can find footholds and handholds to help us to get to the point where we can be like Jesus Christ. We talked earlier in the episode about feeling the spirit and recognizing the spirit. And Jamila, when you said, you made me the way you want me, that's absolutely true. And, uh, and so when God says all are like unto God, that's exactly what he means, that he made us the way he wants us. Mm -hmm.